How you guys doing? I'm Chris Ignato and I want to show you something amazing. Have a look at this incredible Cecropia moth caterpillar. This thing is so cool and uh, I think it's the coolest caterpillar in all of Pennsylvania and it's pretty large. I mean the the hickory horn devil grows to a larger size like three or four times this big but when this emerges as an adult moth it's gonna be the largest moth in North America, the Cecropia moth. Um, but this thing is so cool. I wanna show you some close-up footage. This animal only eats when it's in its larval stage, AKA caterpillar. And the bulk of their diet generally consists of maple or black cherry leaves. I'm sure you can imagine that these caterpillars will just eat tons and tons of leaves and pack on as much volume and body fat as possible. That allows them to metamorphosize into the largest adult possible. If it's a female, her large body will allow her to manufacture as many eggs as possible, and therefore supplying the population with as many of her offspring as she can. You look right here, you see these tiny little projections or tubercles sticking off its back. Well, they're brightly colored. Some of these are red, some are yellow, and that's pretty much as a, a warning to would-be predators. You know, they're covered in spikes, and many caterpillars have urticating hairs. Those spikes are like little hollow tubes, and when touched, they snap and release uh, a fluid or venom that is much like acid. It can cause a lot of itching and stinging and burning. But on other caterpillars, it's just surely the spike or fur that acts as its defense mechanism. So how cool is that? This caterpillar is just incredible looking. The Cecropia moth itself is an amazing species and definitely noteworthy. But uh, I want to thank you for watching this video and hope you enjoyed it. Once again, I'm Chris Ignato, signing out.